much. You know, there's a lot of folks in our area dealing with food insecurity. But there are many organizations working to change that, including the Houston Food Bank. Today on Hunger Action Day, you can help and you can do it right from your couch, your chair, wherever you are. The Houston Food Bank's hosting an online donation drive. The money that's donated will be matched not once, but twice. Joining us this morning to talk about it, Brian Green, president of this uh, and CEO of the Houston Food Bank. Brian, good morning. Love your headset, by the way. Super sharp. <laughs> well, it's, a, it's a noisy here in the kitchen, so it really helps a lot. Thanks for having me on, though. Now, this is great. So online today, we can reach everybody and get that help going. Uh, tell us more about what the food bank does for the community. We have so many new people in town. They don't know about y'all. Sure. So Houston Food Bank, uh, we exist to try and help families who are struggling with food insecurity. Uh, we do this through a network of 1,600 partners who are actually out in the neighborhoods and the schools working with those families and individuals in need. Uh, we have hundreds of volunteers a day. And what we do is we go capture the surplus food, the food that would otherwise be waste. We're currently distributing at a rate of about 14 tractor trailer loads wow. per day, uh, wow. six days a week of actual dis distribution throughout the 18 counties that we serve. You all are just a godsend. I mean, just incredible. We know that September is Hunger Action Month and you've been all over the community. Tell us about some of your events so far. Well, there's a lot going on. Well, we've got one coming up. The, the White House is holding a conference on uh, hunger, nutrition and health in the tie in there. This is the first time one of those conferences has been held by the White House in decades now. We're really looking forward to that. That's on Wednesday. We're going to have a watch party here at the food bank and our own Houston, Natalie Castillo, who is on our uh, neighbor uh, neighbor committee is going to be speaking at that conference. I'm going to be watching for her. Uh, of course, all month you've got uh, Whataburger and, and our Houston Texans are doing a great promo where, you know, donate a dollar to the food bank and get a free Whataburger. We love that. Uh, <laughs> and then, you know, well, we had uh, uh, a great one we did with our student heroes. These are uh, high school students that uh, we teach them leadership skills. We teach them to supervise people. Uh, because we have hundreds of volunteers and so we need supervisors so we actually have high school students doing a lot of the supervision work uh, but we actually brought them in to really be talking about the root causes and what they can do about it so we had a neat event there so there's just a lot going on that's great and we, and we love the youth programs too how important is that uh, brian yeah. let's talk about this on online donation drive that's what i mentioned at the top of our interview here and we want people at home to know what the opportunity is they have today yeah. to go help so in, on any given day, uh, it costs Houston Food Bank about a dollar to distribute three meals. Now that's not because we have a magic wand, it's because what we do is we capture the surplus food, whether it be from the grocery stores, uh, the distribution centers, the manufacturers, and a lot now from the farms. It's amazing. We're, we're doing like five tractor trailer loads just of produce alone per day that we're mostly getting from the farms of what they could not sell. So because we have this great cost efficiency of getting it, we can take a dollar and turn it into three. Well, we have a donor who wished to remain anonymous, who was willing to make it so that now we can do nine meals for a dollar wow. uh, during Hunger Action Month. So if you just go to our website, you click on the ways to give, it'll be right there. You click on it and watch your dollar be multiplied into nine meals. That's something. My God, and, that's and Brian, great. for those who don't yeah. have the extra money right now to help out financially, how else can folks get involved with the Houston Food Bank? <laughs> Oh, that's a good question. Thank you for asking. Well, the biggest way, just like you see right behind me, uh, these are friends from Halliburton. Uh, they're a volunteer. They're getting the meals ready to, to go out. Uh, volunteers are actually our most valuable resource. Uh, so the different operations we do, you come in, you never know what you're going to be working in. You might be bagging rice. You might be sorting through damaged cans, whatever. Um, the average rate, like working in our, in our salvage room, is actually about $75 of output per volunteer hour. Wow. So if you make $75 an hour, good for you. Uh, but if you, you know, like if you gave us all of that, but actually in terms of output to the community, an hour of your time can be worth $75. That's wow. the, the kind of rate of return we're able to get out of that. So we'd love to get people to come and volunteer. We're open seven days a week for volunteers. We're open evenings. Just go to the website, register to volunteer, pick your ship. Come on, bring your kids. Uh, you know, we, you know, we, you know, we do not have to, you know, require that everybody 18 or older, we take kids actually four years and up. Oh, it's fine. Great. Perfect. Yeah. You know, family volunteering opportunities are like no other, you know, Absolutely. it's just so good to get the yeah. whole family involved. And exactly. working with the Houston food bank. I mm. mean, come on, how can you top it? Brian Green, president and CEO of the Houston food bank. Thank you so much for sharing some time with us this morning. It's been great. Thank you and keep up the great work. Yes, likewise. Thanks so much. Thanks, yeah. Brian.